I'm Steve Henderson, principal of Silverland Middle School. We're excited to welcome all our students back to the 2021 school year. This video has been created to give you some updates and model some of the changes for Silverland this school year. This year, it's really important that staff and students follow the self-screening tool put out by the Lyon County School District, which gives uh, um, suggestions on when to stay home, whether or not you have a new respiratory symptom from, uh, could be a cough if you're vomiting or have diarrhea, call the school and tell them that uh, you, need, you need to stay home, that you're sick. Um, also, if you have a fever or if you have a loss of smell or taste, uh, or two of more of these symptoms, muscle aches, fatigue, sore throat, chills, headache, abdominal pain. These are all reasons why you would stay home from school, so make sure you check every day. It is required for students and staff to wear a mask at all times on campus except for when they are eating and drinking, and it must cover their nose and their mouth. Here are some examples of how not to wear your mask. <laughs> Students will enter the school from the back side where the bike racks are and where the buses drop students off. When they walk into the school and while they are in the school throughout the full day, the social distance guidelines are three feet. So students must remain three feet apart from each other at all times. The floors have been marked with arrows so students will know which side of the hallway they can walk down while still keeping three feet apart from each other. Backpacks will be allowed this year because lockers will not be available to students. Students must wait outside their classroom three feet apart until their instructor gives them the signal to go into the classroom. This allows for staff to clean the desks in between transitions. No more than two students are allowed in the bathroom at any given time during the school day. If the bathroom is full, students are expected to wait their turn until a student exits that bathroom. And don't forget, before you exit the bathroom, to thoroughly wash your hands. It's so important at this time. On Mondays through Thursdays, students will have the option of going to the cafeteria or the courtyard to eat their lunch. Students should not share their food at this time, but they may remove their mask while eating and drinking. Students must remain three feet apart in the courtyard and may also remove their masks when they are eating and when they are done eating and drinking, they must put their mask back on. When students finish eating in the courtyard or the cafeteria, they will be required to go to the blacktop by exiting these doors going down this hallway by the gym and turning left and exiting these doors. Once outside, students must remain three feet apart with their mask on at all times. When the bell rings, students will line up and wait for their teacher to take them back to class. All water fountains will be turned off in our school but there are water bottle filling stations next to the office and across from the library that students may use. 
Thanks for watching. Let us know if you have any questions or concerns. We look forward to hearing from you.